Ryan Blytree, executive chef at the original Diner Aunt, and today I'm going to teach you how to make baked herring. Uh, we're going to bake it in a casserole dish. This one is uh, cast iron, so it's nice and heavy and conducts even heat, uh, but it'll work also in any kind of casserole dish that you have at home. And it's nice to serve it right in that dish. It's a pretty nice uh, presentation. Uh, we're going to start with some Yukon Gold potatoes, and I'm going to shingle them in the bottom. I like to slice them nice and thin to make sure that these cook at the same speed as the fish. So when by the time this whole fish is done, you have cooked fish and vegetables and a sauce all in the same container. I'm gonna season these with a little bit of salt and pepper. Uh, next I'm gonna layer in some sliced yellow onions. And now some sliced carrots. And some cloves of garlic. And just a little more salt and pepper on top of these. and some fresh dill. And now I'm gonna pour a little bit of heavy cream over the top. That's gonna serve as my sauce and also have everything cook nice and moist. All right, now that I have that done, I'm gonna set this aside and take my fish and I'm going to season the inside cavities of them. I'm going to line the cavities with some sliced Meyer lemons. And some more fresh dill. like so, and then I'm gonna season the outside of my fish with some more kosher salt, and I'm gonna transfer them to my baking dish. And I'm gonna cook these for about 15 minutes or so at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And when it's all done, You've got perfectly roasted fish, some delicious vegetables, and a dill cream sauce.